so hey guys welcome back to my channel this is another vlog i had such a good morning and then my camera fell and now it is messed up my lens i'm not sure if you guys can even see my lens is like skewed it's basically stuck and when i switch it on it has that message lens error <sighs> guys I'm so annoyed because, yeah. So I was trying to check online how I can fix it myself. Um, Because I really don't want to take it to a technician. I don't want to pay you money to get it fixed. But yeah, it is what it is. I am heading off to a meeting that starts at 1 p.m. It is currently 10 past 12. And then after a meeting, I'm going to go to the mall and just see if they can tell me what I can do to fix it. And I'll make a decision then um, if I'm going to let someone else do it for me or I'm going to attempt doing it myself, fixing the, fixing the camera. But I'm currently recording on my cell phone because I really do want to vlog and I've got a phone so I might as well just use it. Guys... I still don't have a chest of drawer. Those people are supposed to be here at 10 o'clock in the morning. They did not arrive. I'm leaving now. I don't know where they are. And I'm just really just annoyed. So when they do arrive, my sister will be home. She's going to take the chest of drawer for me. I can only hope that it is what I asked them to make. And it looks decent and nice. At this point, I'm just over it and I just want to get my chest of drawer and organize my room, which is what I'll do when I get back from the mall and after my meeting. But yeah, my sister made me breakfast in bed. It was just a nice morning until my camera fell. <sighs> oh, and I also decided to put a bit of makeup on today just to be presentable at the meeting. My brows will need to go get trimmed because the ghetto... No chair. But yeah, I don't feel like wearing a wig. I don't know. Ever since I've gotten into this habit of cutting my hair, I just, I just, yeah, I just walk around like this all the time and I really don't care. But anyways, let me not ramble and get going. I'm just, yeah. Hopefully food and some drinks is going to make up for this mood that I'm currently in now because I was in a good mood earlier on. Anyways, check you guys later. you what i got at the store i found in durbanville i got like four of these bowls retailing for 45 rands each they are like this neutral color i found them really cute and i also got the sculpture or vase whatever you want to call it i'm pretty much going to be using it as a key place i'm going to place my keys here I know at home had something similar a while back, but yeah, I found this for 155. So that's pretty much what I got. And I also got a box of wine and yeah. So now I'm gonna chill and wait and see if this chest of joy is gonna get here. It is currently 12 minutes past six and they still haven't delivered. Anyways, let's see. They said they should be here by seven. We'll see. Finally arrived. It's one o'clock on a Sunday. I know it is an understatement.
Hey guys, so today is Keys Day and I just got back home from work. I went to the office today. I asked my sister to take out some meat so that I can make uh, meat and some veggies, but I decided I'm gonna go to Woolies and buy some lasagna for dinner. It is a cold day. So something nice and cool, well, it's not cool, something cozy and hearty for this weather is perfect and lasagna is that for today i came up with this initiative of one week one person cooks and then the next week somebody else cooks and this week is my week <sighs> and i regret it regret i think that's so regret now yesterday i made pasta today it's a lasagna Tomorrow I'll make a salad, something nice and light because we can't be eating up all this heavy food. But yeah, I did ask my sister to put out some meat because I thought I was going to make something else. But yeah, this will take me 30 minutes. I'm going to pop it in the oven and let it bake. Is it bake? I think mean, let it bake for 30 minutes. So yeah. I still don't have a camera, um, so I did call in at Canon and they told me that I need to call ORMS. Don't mind what that says here, guys. It is what it is. But anyways, I always feel like on my vlogs, I've been looking raggedy F, but it's good. It's all cool. Anyways, I did ask... Um, Canon about repairing my camera and they referred me to this company and basically they charge you 400 rands if 400 rand guys just to assess what's wrong with the camera this amount is not deducted from the amount they're going to quote you for the actual repair so the ghetto so I'm still using my camera to vlog I'm not even sure if I'm in frame or not. <laughs> I can only hope. I have it against some dishes. But yeah, I'm only hoping for the best. I'm going to try out this yogurt. It's called Double Cream Clem and Gold Yogurt. Um, I normally enjoy this one, this lemon curd one. This is a favorite of mine from Woolies. But I'm going to try out this one. Oh, I got a, pass a parcel here. So when I order things now from like take a lot, I no longer ask for them to be delivered to my place. I prefer picking them up from a pickup point and there's one qu quite close to my place. So it's not a train smash. And I always find that with having it delivered at a pickup point, you actually get the product faster. Like for example, this parcel was only supposed to get to me on Thursday and it's here on tuesday it's here on tuesday so let me quickly show you guys what i bought and the nice thing with the pickup points they open um to like 7 p.m with the one at valvo opens till 7 p.m and you can actually just schedule when you're gonna go there and pick it up compared to having been at home and waiting for your delivery to actually arrive so that's why i just prefer pick up points because yeah it's at your discretion when you want to go fetch it but obviously it's up until a certain day that they allow you to go pick it up otherwise it goes back to the warehouse I don't even remember what I bought yes. Let's see. What is this? What are you? What are you? What are you? Not what I expected, shall. But it's a strap for my I watch my Apple watch I thought it was metallic I clearly did not read the description to check the material child it's not bad though I just wanted a black one so that's that 
um i got some makeup brushes these were on sale a beauty blender nice and soft and basically these makeup brushes there's 14 of them now if you don't have why are they not written what that brush is for what the hell am i supposed to know Sean? and then this is basically the makeup the brush bag to put them in I actually thought the bag was going to open like this. But anyways, how am I supposed to know what brush is for what? Okay, I'll check the details on the thing that I ordered from. And then the main thing I actually wanted was a hard drive. So I bought this Toshiba hard drive for my laptop it had good reviews it's a one terabyte um people said it's fast it's got a two-year warranty so yeah this is the main thing i went to go buy and take a lot don't ask me how i put everything else in my cart and then i also bought this makeup brush cleaner i saw someone using it a couple of times on instagram and because I hate washing brushes, I thought, let me buy one. But basically, that's how it looks. And I'll test it out with my old um, brushes to see if it works properly or what. But yeah. This is basically it. I'm not going to assemble it now, but yeah, it looks like that, guys the time i'm gonna say i put the thing in a quarter two so yeah that's pretty much what i bought to take a lot and i'm just gonna make dinner eat have a glass of wine and just do some editing because i have to put out a video tomorrow i promised people i'll put up a video tomorrow so i just need to finish editing that video and then i'll put it in that So the lasagna was yummy. That's just me and my wine. Watching some TV. Nothing depresses me like that corner. I need my chest of drawer to be done. So I can have some peace and order in my room. But until then, it's me, wine, TV, work, the works. If it's not chest of drawers, it's me having camera issues. <clears throat> but it is what it is, Sha. Kanchungin. What a mess. Everything is just in that basket. Anyway, it is what it is. Look at that mess. <sighs> Firstly, I need to pack away those clothes. And everything that's there needs to go in the chest of drawers. It's only arriving Saturday afternoon, apparently. So, hey guys, today's Friday and I just got done with work. I decided to work from home today because I was way too lazy to head over to the office. It was so cold, guys. Yo, kia banda. Like, it's cold. Uh, so, I decided to work from home. And, yeah, it's been chilled vibes. Now, I'm going to unpack or pack away some of my laundry that my sister done in the week my room is a mess if you watch my previous vlog you will know that i had some drama with a company that was supposed to make me a chest of drawer so i reached out to another company and they delivered hey it is definitely what i wanted um in terms of design it's quite big and yeah i'm going to basically hey clean up this mess all those clothes are clean, by the way. And then this is all the stuff we, that were in my previous chest of drawer. So I'm going to tidy that up. And then, 
Yeah, let me quickly show you guys the chest of drawer. Oof. So this is the chest of drawer. It's four drawers and it doesn't have handles. Um, I'll show you guys a picture here on the side of what I asked for and then this is basically what I got. So it's pretty much the design and I'm pretty much happy with it. So yeah. Let me unpack this mess or pack away this mess, sort out things that I actually don't need. And then this is where the chest of drawers is going to be situated. And yeah, I'm also going to pack away my PC because I don't work weekends, show. <laughs> the chest of drawer it fits in perfectly i am loving it it's very minimal it's very simple and yeah the only thing i was like mm, was this gap over here but he claims that if he didn't have that gap it would be hard for me to open them but yeah it's really not a train smash it's exactly the design that i wanted so basically that's how you open it quite big also inside so i'm really really happy i am going to pack away all of this in here so my previous one had five drawers and this one has four so the top section is going to be my makeup and some of my accessories and then i'm thinking hmm, i'm not sure if the second and third one should be like my gym stuff and underwear and whatnot and then the last drawer be my laptops and whatnot or should the laptop and take stuff be on the second drawer so that it's easily reachable when i'm working everything for me has to be functional so yeah i'll see but definitely the first drawer is going to be makeup so let's get started This is pretty much the setup for now. Um, nothing is set in stone yet. I will play around with it until I am happy. But yeah, this drawer basically houses my makeup and my sunglasses. I am going to wash all of this, so no judgment, please. And then over here is pretty much my work stuff so my work laptop and then underneath it is like headphones and chargers then my personal laptop which chances are i'm going to be using a lot um and then it's just like my hard drive power banks and then my notepads and yeah stationery and all of that and then the last two drawers, it's my underwear, which I'm not going to show you guys. But yeah, this is pretty much the vibe that I'm going for right now. I'm going to make myself a cup of tea and something to eat. I know for a Friday night, that sounds boring. But yeah, that's pretty much going to be my Friday. So yeah, guys, that's it for today's video. I know some of you guys might have questions regarding the chest of drawers, so I got it made by a small business in Strand. This cost me two grand. I am not 100% sure with how I feel about the gap. I'll see after a couple of days, but I think there is a way to fix it um, if it does bother me. I think they can put an extra layer of wood over there, painted white so that it matches, and that should fix the problem. But I'll see how I feel after a couple of days. Otherwise, I'm really happy with my chest of drawer. It is big, it is spacious, it fits everything I needed to fit. 
and i'm really happy i'm just gonna play around with the deco pieces until i feel like it's what i want it to be in terms of putting everything in place but for now it will do and yeah it's i really like it <laughs> i really really like it they actually managed to do what i wanted i'm actually going to put a picture if i can find one of what the first company did that i asked to make me a chest of drawer and you guys can tell me if you think what they did and what i asked them to do is the same thing because it's not and these guys actually nailed it so i'm really happy they did use wood um they didn't use like expensive expensive wood i think they used super wood instead of melamine because initially i thought it's going to be melamine like my desk but it's actually not it's wood but anyways i'm really happy with the outcome i'm happy with the product and yeah otherwise this is the end of this video please make sure you do like guys please subscribe it really won't cost you anything but it will mean the world to me otherwise i'll see you guys on my next video bye